I use they them pronouns um, and my New Year's resolution for 2023 is to come out to my family uh, and I mean they know I'm queer obviously <laughs> but I just like refuse to address it um, but it's got to the point where like the elephant is the size of the fucking room so I've decided I've got to do something about it um, and this whole refusal to come out thing started when I was pretty young like I was in about year eight when I realized that I wasn't straight um, and in my year eight brain I was like oh, Coming out is so heteronormative. <laughs> it's, it's just straight until proven gay. <laughs> I don't want to come out. If I get a girlfriend, I'll tell my family, but that's the extent of it. So that's what I settled on. If I have a girlfriend, I'll tell them. Yeah, I'm sure you see where this is going. I have zero riz. <laughs> I committed to this concept when I was 12. I am now 20. Uh, that's my luck with women. <laughs> Eight years I could have been comfortably out to my family, but no, I fated myself to be trapped in this closet of glass. Um, it's so bad too because I'm quite an emotional person, so whenever topics of gay or trans rights were brought up at the dinner table, I would just cry if anyone said anything remotely homophobic or transphobic, which is like a bit fucking sus. <laughs> and so my mum would come to me the next day and be like, hey, what the fuck was that about? And I, who was the co-president of the LGBT society at school, would, was just like, yeah, I have a lot of queer friends, um, like Elo babes. Crying when your aunt says she wouldn't want any of her relatives to be gay is not really giving, I just have a lot of queer friends. <laughs> um, and also this promise to myself that I will announce my queerness to my family by the girlfriend I will someday acquire um, is kind of its own worst enemy because it puts a lot of pressure on any relationships I have with women. Um, like I'll be on a first date with a girl and in the back of my mind I'm thinking, this is the one. <laughs> this woman will stop me living a lie. <laughs>